And then there is also Sahaba and Dalat, which I didn't have time to talk about, but that was, that's something which is going to, is effect be seen later on. Because the people who have the, this Sahab, uh, Dalat justice uh, uh, shares, basically they are going to demand it and they're going to create problems in the future. We haven't finished with Mr. Alter. A lot of this implication is going to be there for a long time. Uh, so the bottom line here is that what I have basically tried to do here is try to convince you with some data and some theoretical analysis and comparison with other countries that the source of Iranian problem, and there are many problems in Iran, the main source which manifests itself is allowing the inflation to be high and sustainable at this, uh, unsustainable at this level, way above the rest of the world. You cannot be different from and that has led to inflation in exchange rate depreciation, which is episodic, which then, uh, when the exchange rate depreciates, inflation rises much faster. And then, if, if you try to control it, then, then it accumulates, it gives rise to a second round, and so on and so on. And then what happens at the end of the day, you somehow, you really need to try to look at the causes of this problem, develop institutions, diversify the Iranian economy, they, they try to, Develop a new social contract. Whoever runs Iran, they need a new social contract. Social contract, by that I mean between the rules and the rulers. You need a new understanding. What are the capacity of Iran? How do you operate? And how to integrate this with the rest of the world? So I'm going to stop here and there is other questions. Thank you so much. future of 